guys welcome back to my youtube channel those of you are new here my name is preet bira welcome to my channel so i know everyone loves skincare right even i also love skincare so today's video is going to be all about skincare steps you need to take care at home so today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how i remove my makeup so you don't need too much of products to do that i'm just showing you a steps that what i do so whatever products you have you can just follow the steps accordingly and then yeah that way you can just remove your makeup so i'm just going to be sharing you a very easy peasy steps that um which will be very beneficial for your skin and make sure guys if you wear a makeup you should remove your makeup before going to bed because if you leave the makeup on and you sleep it will cause a lot a lot of damage to your skin so yeah let's go and let's start the video and i request you guys to please subscribe to my channel so let's begin so first of all before removing a makeup make sure you are removing all the jewelry everything so that you don't hurt yourself and the next step is if you're wearing a false eyelashes make sure you remove them very gently and now i'm also wearing a contact lenses so i'm going to be removing a contact lenses now the first step which i do i take a makeup remover and this is my favorite makeup remover which is a wet and wild makeup remover it is a very affordable makeup remover which works really good and it cleans the makeup like boom like that it works really really good and it's definitely my favorite and it also come comes up with this pump now i take the cotton pads and i place them on both of my eyes i just start uh, like rolling my cotton into circular motions and start removing the makeup just make sure you guys are very very gentle and now the next step which i'm going to be taking is a pons cold cream makeup remover guys this is not a cream this is a makeup remover but it looks like a cream as you guys can see so this is a makeup remover or a makeup balm you can say you just need to take a little bit amount of the product on your fingers and just warm it up on your fingers and then apply it on your uh, face like usually apply a moisturizer or any sunscreen so just apply it on your face and then start your hand movements in a circular motion so that all the makeup can be removed from your face and just do that very slowly and very gently you don't have to be harsh with your skin so just be very very gentle and start rolling your fingers in a circular motion now to remove the product i am using a hot water towel if you guys want you can just directly wash your face but i am using a hot water towel because it actually works really good in um, removing this product from your face and all the makeup from your face so just do it very gently like i said you don't have to be very harsh and if you guys want you can just directly wash your face also i usually don't use a face wash after i have used the makeup balm, makeup remover balm this time to show you guys i am using a neutrogena hydro boost hydrating cleansing gel which is an amazing face wash and it works really well and it is also um, known for removing the makeup from your face so yeah just again apply it on your face and just your hand movement should be in a circular motion keep massaging it guys but make sure not more than like Two three minutes. Two three minutes are enough, and then yeah, wash your face with a little warm water, or you can use cold water. It's totally up to you. But here, as shown, I'm again using a hot water towel. Now, once your face is clean and it's not wet. The next product which I'm going to be using is a face pack. You can use any of your favorite face pack, but I am using Elemis Super Food uh, Vital Veggie Mask, which is super super good and it's very gentle on your skin. It helps um, removing all the dirt from your skin and also hydrates your skin. I love this mask. The smell is really good. Then I'm using the silicone brush to apply this mask evenly on my face. Now this mask is uh, not very very thick and not very thin the consistency is really really good and you can easily apply this mask on your face even with your fingers but i'm using a brush to apply this mask on your face and then make sure you guys that you don't leave any area but definitely don't apply it on your eyelids or on your lips uh, so many people forget this thing but you guys also need to take care of your neck area so i'm also applying this mask on my neck also make sure you guys are not applying the mask regularly I usually apply the mask like twice a week or maybe once a week. Now I'm going to keep this mask for like about 10 minutes and then you can wash the mask. 
now we have a very very clean face we are done with makeup remover we have washed a face we have used a face wash we are also done with the back so now i'm going to be using a toner so this time i'm using a botanics shine away mattifying toner so i have oily skin and this toner works beautiful on uh, on people who have oily skin so using a cotton pad i would be uh, just applying this on my skin so that just in case if there's any little amount of makeup product left on my face that can be removed from my face i am using a serum so for the serum i'm taking innisfree green tea seed serum which is a very nice serum so you can definitely use this uh, product highly highly recommend it so after washing your face guys after toner you need to use a serum first before applying the moisturizer apply the serum evenly on your skin i am using vitamin c from clairs this is my all time favorite product it will definitely help in hydrating my skin vitamin c also helps in repairing your skin and also moisturizes your skin you can also apply the vitamin c directly on your lips it really works amazing and it works amazing for all skin type people this product is highly highly recommended now once i have applied the vitamin c what i usually do is i use a jade roller you can buy the jade roller from nika people who are from india you can buy it from nika and otherwise you can also get it from sephora there are various options where you can buy the jade roller so i use a jade roller and then i just start rolling it on my skin now what actually it does it it helps in some blood circulation it increases the blood and also it will help in soothing your skin it is actually kind of a massage which is, which you're doing on your skin and then it also helps in getting that glow that natural glow on your skin so that's why i, I usually do that and I feel very relaxed after I have used the jade roller. So must try it out. I know you guys will like it. Now once that is done, uh the next part comes is a moisturizer which I never forget and I always mention that never never forget your moisturizer. So I'm using a Hydra Genius moisturizer from L'Oreal. and even the apply the moisturizer on your face just apply everything in a circular motion and then make sure you're pushing your skin in a upwards movement not in a bottom like pushing it up not in a downward so make sure you do that and also apply it evenly on your neck never forget your neck area i also need to moisturize my lips so for doing that i'm using a kosas sport uh, lip fuel and it is again one of my favorite product and yeah that's it so this is all steps which i take now this is an optional step uh, if you guys want you can totally skip it but i always do that i'm using a cordly gold beauty elixir mist and i just apply it like spray it on my face because it actually soothes my skin and i love this product this is a limited edition so i don't know whether still you guys can get it or not and then once that is done i am using a witchy i think mineral mist and it will help in uh, providing the refreshment on my face and this way i'll feel more fresh so yeah that's it you guys these are the products which i use and these are the steps which i take to remove the makeup from my face easy peasy you don't have to like not a big deal you don't have to use too many products it's just like normal thing normal process which i do and that's it you guys i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and if you guys does Don't forget to like this video and share it with your friends. I'm signing off from this video right now. I'm going to see you guys super soon with a brand new video but make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. Also press the notification bell icon. I'll see you guys soon. Till then take care. Bye and stay safe.